Konnichiwa minasan, my name is Jay. Welcome to our channel, Chen XJ. Before we proceed, I would give thanks to our friends from Sona for again sending us these products. Today's video, we are going to do an unboxing and review of three Sona Zigbee products. The first one is the Zigbee LCD Smart Temperature and Humidity Sensor. One, it is Zigbee device is still the same. It is a temperature and humidity sensor. So this one, the difference is that this has no LCD screen. Finally, the last Zigbee product that we are going to review is this one. So this is a Zigbee smart switch. So any further ado, let's start the unboxing and review. So we are now going to unbox the smart temperature and humidity sensor with LCD. This is the box, typical orange zone of box. And at the back, there are the details regarding this sensor so let's try to open first is the manual let's open the manual follow the things that are written in the manual and the unit itself the unit has two parts first is the back panel and the unit the unit has a pull tab when you pull that one you will turn the unit on as you can see there is a large screen so also at the back there is a tiny button when you press this button you will be able to change the configuration from degrees celsius to fahrenheit also there is a stand you can pull the stand down and yeah you can place it any table or any place also the back panel there is a 3m tape if you want to stick it on to any surface but you can also stick it into metal surface since it is magnetic so other specification it is zigbee 3 connection working temperature is from 9.9 .9 to minus 6 degrees celsius working humidity is 5 percent to 95 percent relative humidity battery model is cr2450 3 volts battery life is two years also it can work with alexa and google home coverage area is up to 400 feet it is also home assistant capable also it is zigbee standard capable data storage and export and finally it can do smart scenes now going to open the e-wheeling app assign this sensor to be the thermometer on our entrance area so let's click on the thermometer icon you can see the temperature and the relative humidity so in the history you can look at the daily last seven days monthly and half a year also you can change the temperature unit from degree celsius to fahrenheit or vice versa that is it for our first zigbee device Boxing and review of the sonoff smart temperature and humidity sensor with lcd we are now going to unbox and review the next zigbee device it's still the same with the first one it is a temperature and humidity sensor but the difference is this one has no lcd so let's now unbox this so the box still the same same zone of box orange box with some specification written around the box so we are now going to open the box so as usual upon opening the box there are three items inside first is the manual second is the mounting plate and finally the sensor itself let's inspect one by one so the manual again just follow the steps on how to set up the next one it is the mounting plate mounting plate is made out of metal so there are two options on how to mount this first is by using a 3m tape you can also use a screw with the metal plate so you can screw it to any wooden material or any material that can be screwed on and also you can mount this one on any metal surface since the sensor itself is magnetic 
finally the sensor itself so it is made out of plastic and there is also a pull tab so this tab you will turn on the sensor one button so this button is for connecting press this button upon setup so let's try to pull the tab pulling the tabs as you can see there is a red light blinking the red light means that it is trying to find a zigbee hub and also the red flashing light also signifies that it is the time to set it up with the e-wheeling app specifications for this sensor so wireless connection is zigbee 3.0 so the working temperature it is minus 10 to 60 degrees celsius working humidity 5 to 95 percent relative humidity battery model is cr2477 battery life four years also it can connect to alexa and google home home assistant compatible zigbee standard compatible data storage and export also it can do smart scenes again Let's open the eWeeLink app. So I named this one Thermometer Outside. You can check for the temperature and relative humidity of the outside. Same as the sensor with the LCD. Same features. You can view the history daily, 7 days, monthly, and half a year. You can also export this one. Think that is it for the temperature and humidity sensor without the lcd now let's proceed on the third and last zigbee device that sonoff has sent us we will now unbox the sonoff smart switch so in what is inside the box there is the manual the switch and the metal plate again the manual just follow the what is written on the manual and then uh, mounting metal plate still the same and the unit itself so this one is the smart switch the form factor is the same as the temperature humidity sensor without the lcd also same pairing button and then pull tab so let's try to pull the tab and it is turned on so it is now searching for a hub so the specifications of the smart switch it is zigbee wireless connection is zigbee working temperature is from minus 10 to 60 degrees celsius battery model same as before cr2477 the battery life is an amazing four years net weight is 27.8 grams one switch but with three actions so this is a powerful switch it can also trigger alexa routines act as a doorbell emergency button and also there are icon stickers for specific use so let's try to open the eWeeLink app so as you can see i assigned it as a switch so there are records uh, which i had last double clicked it so when we open the alexa app and then go to routines i have assigned it as a when you press the button uh, certain lights in our house will be triggered it will turn on see on this video single press uh, she turned on the fan and then double press it to turn on the coffee maker and finally when she pressed the long press everything will turn off and trigger routines from Alexa also it can record your history of usage that is it for the review and unboxing of the three Zigbee products that Sonoff had sent us. If you want to purchase each of the items, just check out on the description box below. Please use the affiliate link if you want to purchase. If you have any other questions regarding these products, just write it on the comment section. And I will make sure that I will answer you as soon as possible. So I think that is it. See you on the next one. Bye. Peace.